Welcome back everybody to Techspress. I'm going to be showing you how to add a feature product slider inside of Shopify. So the very first thing you want to do is to focus into your Shopify store. Once you're in here, let's go directly into customize. But before we go into customize, you want to make sure that you go into your products and you have like the right product for making the actual slider. In this case, I wanted to make like a slider for this actual product. So I'm going to hit into my product and as you can see, I have the specifications, the title, the status. And if I scroll down, I have like a media. You need to have, for example, let's say at least three or four images to have like a really great slider show to customize this actual section. So what I want to do is to go directly to my editor of Shopify. So once you are here into your editor, you might see that you have here your image, your product, for example, here it is. So let's say that I wanted to add like a feature product here. I'm going to go into here into add section to the template. And here, what I want to do is to look out for a slideshow. So here into slideshow, what I can do is to click here. And now, as you can see here, I can click into my slideshow, select the image. And inside the images, what I want to do is to get started with the product that I have just added into my actual store. In this case, it should be a little bit scrolling down. It should be actually this one. So I choose one and this one should be image number one. Now I click here, let's go for image number two. So usually I wanted to add like the buy button till the second image. So I click here and I don't want to see the button label. So usually what I do is to don't contain the container and desktop. Now I scroll a little bit down, button label, I just delete the button label. The subheading should not be there. The image slider, of course, should not be there. So now let's go into the second image and this is the part where I wanted to add like, like buy button. So here into the image slide, I go here into show container and desktop. And there we go. Here into the button label, let's go and scroll a little bit up and hit into buy now. So now here, let's go for get yours at 50% off now. And in, into image slide, let's go for the best headphones or headset 2023, like that. So I'm going to hit down into save and we are now successfully done. If you wanted to add like a slider inside a product that you are selling, well, what you wanted to do is to go into the upper side. Let's go into the product that you wanted to edit, which in my case is this one. And as you can see, I have one, two, three, four, five, six images or even seven images to look at my product. What I wanted to do is to try to change how it's going to be looking my product at the end of the day. So if I go and scroll into desktop layout, let's go for thumbnail carousel. I hit now to save and my product is now successfully added. So you can do exactly the same thing with all your products to edit those. I can go now into exit and there we go. There's another solution that you can go into customize or you can go into the edit the code and you can go directly here where you can go into the theme liquid and add your custom HTML file to have like a slideshow of our products. But usually this is a little bit more advanced. So if you wanted to check that out, you can leave that in the comment below and we can show you how to do this. But this is how we can get started like in a very easy, easy way with our products. So uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel guys if you want to see more great tools and how we can get started editing stuff from Shopify and your products, of course. So thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully guys, we can all see you next time.